Hi, this is Natalie Rydstrom from SBR Picks. Crystal Palace and Leicester go head-to-head -head on Saturday at Selhurst Park. And joining us now to preview this match from a betting perspective is Stuart from betadvisor.com. Stuart, thanks for being here. Hi, Natalie. Now, the odds for this match are neck and neck, uh, with the slightly shorter odds being given to Crystal Palace, possibly because of the home advantage, and they're priced at 2.7, whilst Leicester, who beat Manchester United, are called 5-3, are priced 2.9, and the draw 3.4. Which way do you lean? I personally lean towards the away win on this one. Uh, I'm not... I, I can understand why the bookies have got Crystal Palace as favourites. Uh, they are the home team, but I... I just looking at it, I think it, it's not right. It just doesn't seem right to me. Mm -hmm. What did you make of Leicester City's performance against Manchester United? And are you expecting them to deliver as many goals? Uh, not expecting them to deliver as many goals, but it was a pretty phenomenal performance. Apparently, the players went to the manager and said, we want to attack, we want to go for it, we want to show what we can do. And that's exactly what they did. I mean, they really attacked the spaces that Manchester, left be Manchester United left behind. Mm -hmm. And uh, I don't see Crystal Palace being quite so naive, really. I mean, Neil Warnock may not be the world's greatest manager. I, a few of my friends are Crystal Palace fans and they were tearing their hair out when he got appointed. But... Uh, he, you know, he's played a thousand, had a thousand league games as, as managerial experience. You don't get that far if you don't know what you're doing. So I would be very, very surprised if he set his team up anything like Manchester United did, and we saw anything like that number of goals. Yeah. What well, do you think, though, um, the, the the five three result against Manchester United would have given Leicester City some confidence and maybe want to want to try out the same sort of attacking approach approach as they did uh, they did do? Uh, so can you see them taking that approach and this also being a high scoring game? Well, it wasn't so much the attacking approach that really did it for them. It was more the fact they didn't give Manchester United any time on the ball. And that will certainly serve them well when they come up against Crystal Palace because that's another physical side. Yeah. So I'm expecting to see a few cautions. I might even see a red card in this one. Um, are we going to see as many goals? No, probably not. You, you probably get the over two and a half, but... 5-3, yeah. no. I yeah, wouldn't, no. wouldn't expect anywhere near that many. Well, Palace have pocketed 8 and conceded 10 uh, this season. Uh, Leicester have pocketed 9 and conceded 8. So I think this match definitely does have the potential of being a high-scoring game. And the over 2.5 goals there, that's priced at 2.1 uh, compared to the under 2.5 goals, which is priced at 1.8. Uh, would you take the bet and do you see value on the over 2.5 goals priced at 2.1? I think it's reasonable at 2.1. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, I'd always want better, but certainly that's enticing enough to probably get me into the market. Mm -hmm. uh, both of these teams, well, Crystal Palace are pretty good at linking goals and uh, Leicester City, they've got a pretty good spearhead in uh, Ojoa, who's a, a good striker, certainly good in the air, despite his uh, smaller stature, shall we say. And yeah, I think we can see some goals in this one. All right. So uh, this brings us to the top tip, Stuart. Uh, what, what is the top tip you have for us today? Well, our Premier League specialist, Jason Mills, has come through for us once again. And he's going uh, probably a little bit safer for me. He's going for Leicester plus Nort. And that's 2.04 with Bet Victor. Mm -hmm. um, I'm, I'm actually going for the Leicester straight win. And once again, that's with Bet Victor, who seem to be pushing out on their odds recently. They seem to be doing, offering some pretty high odds. And you can get 2.88 on that so I'm, I'm going for the away win but our Premier League specialist is going it's going a little bit more sensibly with uh, just Leicester plus Nord. All right wonderful two tips there to consider. Stuart is from betadvisor.com a multi-sport multi-tipster platform and if you want to check out their website and the services they offer simply click the logo on the top right of the screen. Stuart thanks for joining us. No problem. The SBR network offers free sports picks and game breakdowns. Big money free betting contests year round, a real time Vegas style odds monitoring service, and much more. So come see for yourself. To stay updated on SBR news and promotions, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Google. And do be sure to subscribe to the Sportsbook Review YouTube channel to catch all our daily sports shows.